Thank you, Mr. Chairman, and thank you, uh, Ranking Member Feinstein. Uh, we have Frank Volk with us today. His wife, Angie Volk, and his son, Garrett, and daughter, Lauren Volk, whose essay on Italian heritage I had the pleasure of reading. Uh, they weren't able to make it today as graduation season is upon us back in Charleston, West Virginia, and that's where they are. As a fellow West Virginian, I'm honored to sit here with my friend and colleague, Senator Capito, to introduce Frank Volk, the President's nominee for the U.S. District Court Judge of the United States District Court for the Southern District of West Virginia, and a proud Italian, I might add. Uh, as many of you know, Frank's resume is impressive. The West Virginia University undergraduate and law school graduate is currently the chief judge of the United States Bankruptcy Court for the Southern District of West Virginia, where he has worked since he was appointed by the U.S. Court of Appeals for the Fourth Circuit in 2015. I would like to take a moment to talk about the seat Frank is being nominated for. If confirmed, Frank will be filling a seat that was vacated by Judge Copenhaver, who is also a tremendous jurist and a good friend who took senior status at 93 years of age. Uh, judge Copenhaver was appointed in 1976 and was one of the few remaining active judges appointed by President Ford. And Frank had the honor of serving as his career law clerk for over a decade until assuming his current position as chief bankruptcy judge for the Southern District of West Virginia. During his career, Frank has worked with a number of esteemed judges. Judge Hayden, U.S. District Judge for the Southern District of West Virginia, as a term a law clerk and then later as a career law clerk for almost a decade. Judge M. Blaine Michael, U.S. Court of Appeals for the Fourth Circuit, as a term law clerk. And Judge John Copenhaver, U.S. District Judge for the Southern District of West Virginia, as a career law clerk for over a decade. Even with all those accolades, Frank knows and understands the value of hard work. West Virginia and the federal bench need judges who are thoughtful, hardworking, exhibit a high level of intellect. Frank fits that role perfectly. Frank brings such a great level of experience to the bench, and I can safely say that I am pleased that President Trump has nominated him to continually serve the West Virginia judiciary. Thank you, Mr. Chairman.